Next, we're going to find the base dimensions of a pyramid, given the height and the volume. So it's just another example of us working backwards. Let's recall that the volume formula for a pyramid is one-third times capital B times H, where B stands for the base area. Okay, let's read the problem. The base of the following pyramid is a square. If the volume of the pyramid is 180 cubic feet, what is the missing length? Round your answer to the nearest hundredth. So let's take a look in the problem. In the problem, we know the height is 10 feet. And it looks like we're solving for the missing dimension of the square, which is s. So let's first set up our problem and figure out what the base area has to be. So in this problem, we would have an 180 equals 1 third times capital B, the base area, which we do not know, times the height, which is 10. I would solve this and get the base area equals 54 square feet. Okay, I solved for base area first because I knew the H, and I knew the V, and I was solving for base area. Now that I know the base area, and that my base is a square, I can figure out what S is. S is just going to be 54 equals S squared. So S is the square root of 54, which is approximately 7.348. The problem tells me to round to the nearest hundredth, which means that the length of my side is close to 7.35.